19 to 20,000 people. That's how many people attend the Williamson County Fair. But would you believe me if I said it started just three years ago? Well, that's the truth. And people tell me it's growing quite quick. Everybody in this community comes together for a great cause. It all started when county commissioners realized we've never actually had a Williamson County Fair. President of the Williamson County Fair Association, Brian Borches, says that all changed in 2020. Some great folks got together, put their minds together, some resources together, formed the organization, and here we are three years in. But it's not all fun and games, and that's a good thing. That's what County Commissioner Russ Bowles says. You know, you know, agriculture is still king in Williamson County. We have tens of thousands of acres in production, and so this is, this is kind of respecting our heritage and the people that are here doing it today. CBS Austin meteorologists are predicting some rain in the forecast for this year's fair, but don't let that ruin your plans. We, we have a lot of stuff that's going on in the arena. So rodeo is going to be covered, concerts going to be covered, all of the uh, craft vendors are going to be covered. Which is great because fair and rodeo executive director Kelly Hernandez says it's going to be their best year yet. We have, we have grown exponentially over the last couple of years. The attractions that we've got, the talent that we've brought in. A tradition in the making. We're really setting this up for the future. A family fun experience and a tradition that many hope will stick. Reporting in Williamson County, Abigail Velez, CBS Austin News. Thank you for watching. Please hit the subscribe button and get the latest news by downloading the CBS Austin News app.